good evening to you all. And it is my pleasure to welcome you to this evening's event and also to show my appreciation on behalf of myself and management for responding to our invitation to be at this evening's event. It's a brief but significant event on the calendar of activities of our university. And the purpose this evening, as our registrar already mentioned, for me essentially is to induct Professor Ebenezer Udrowusu to the UG Courtyard of Fame, where he joins his predecessors who have served as executive heads of this institution over the years. We do this as part of our efforts to immortalize their contribution towards the running of this great university. As has been mentioned earlier on, Professor Ebenezer Drosu came into office in August 2016. And this was at a time where a few yet critical laws governing the running of public institutions were enacted. This included the Public Financial Management Act and the Amended Procurement Act. What this meant was that we needed a change in the way that we had been running things so far. And it meant a change to our financial management processes. And I often say that change management is one of the toughest parts of management. And so we had to lead these processes. And it included strengthening units such as the internal audit and establishing a risk management office. And these efforts over the years, we saw yielded results. And indeed, yesterday this was recognized by the internal audit agency as its 2021 conference. And so Professor Ebenezer Drowusu, our immediate past vice chancellor, uh, was given the award of the best head of covered entity that supports internal <laughs> audit units. 2020, the MDA category. Congratulations, Prof. And I think he deserves another round of applause. So, distinguished ladies and gentlemen, we've now reached a very important part of the program, unveiling of the bust of Professor Ebenezer Udru Ousu, the purpose for which we are here. And at this time, it is my singular honor to invite our immediate past Vice Chancellor, Professor Ebenezer Udru Ousu together with his spouse to the bust. And they will be assisted by the moderator of the Presbyterian Church of Ghana, Right Reverend Professor Joy Manti. about going home after so many years of hard work to make this university great? Well, um, I think it's a kind of a mixed feeling, actually. Uh, you feel happy, 
after five years going back to rest um, to reflect on your life do things that you couldn't do during the five years again the other side of it is that well you also feel uh, not too well that you cannot remain to do what you think you can do for the investment but you know i think it's ended and ended well the lord has made his way now prof you wanted to tell us i am um, what what ex what exactly are you going to be doing during your vacation oh currently i'm on i'm on two year leave um sabbatical leave i hope to spend part of my leave farming on my farm that's all enjoy plants enjoy animals and then have have a different lifestyle altogether now prof as as children and as young people who look up to you to see to, and we see ourselves in your shoe one day what advice can you give us yeah that's exactly what i said there's nothing that you can do on your own you have to grow your faith and be very dependent on god and i i, I honestly i pray that all of you in bible you the quality of truthfulness and honesty i think that's the only way you can make it in life no matter how intelligent you are if you are not truthful you are not honest if you are not god fearing it will become very difficult for you here to make it so these are the advice that i will give to you thank you very much prof we wish you all the best